Yeah, that's the closest I can get. It was pretty difficult to get this close because all the roads are not finished yet. There's a lot of infrastructure that still needs to be done. That will be the new home of GKS coming uh, in spring. Now let's go to Bukovo for the last time. Hi everyone, welcome back to another Magic Vlog. We're in Dom, Katowice, and it's an emotional day today because this is the last ever game at Bukova. So for a lot of GKS fans, it will be a special occasion. Unfortunately, today's game will have another emotional factor to it. Uh, last week, tragically, uh, GKS legend Jan Fultok passed away. There is some talks going around of naming the new stadium after him, so it would be nice. Legend at GKS won the cup. And then he moved to Germany to play for Hamburg and Frankfurt. There's a big tribute planned for him today, so it's a perfect send-off. But the opponents for today are Lechia Gdansk. They're fighting for points. They're deep in the relegation zone, so it's not going to be an easy match. Uh, GKS is not really in the best form. It is a bit surreal realizing that this is probably the, the last time I will see Bukova. But I'm also looking forward to the new stadium. So yeah, let's go there one more time. Let's go.
First half from Kickass uh, controlled most of the match. At the end, Lechia had a big chance, but uh, very well saved by Kudla. But overall, not much chances created from both sides. But yeah, Kickass was more efficient. Let's see what the second half can bring. And close Bukova with a win. The next day. Good morning on this foggy morning. I have to do a quick review before something in the fog grabs me. So a good solid win. First half was for Gikas, they controlled it. Second half, Legia was pushing, but the defense held. 22 points after 17 games, uh, that's a pretty good result for Gikas. For Legia Gdansk, first of all, fair play to their fans for coming in that amount of number. Uh, probably while I'm drinking this coffee, they just arrived back in Gdansk. But yeah, for them and also Slansk, they need to upgrade their squad during the winter break. The only question is, are they willing to spend the money for it? We'll have to see in the next coming months. The tribute to Jan Food Talk yesterday was beautiful. We were able to say goodbye to Bukova and Jan with a win. But it still feels weird saying goodbye to the Bukova Stadium. Witnessed many games there together with you guys. From sitting in the snow and witnessing some impressive derbies, including my first ever Ruch Gekers Derby. It's time to go to the new stadium. There will be some big matches. Oh, Jesus. There will be some big matches there. So stay tuned for that. But for the footballing part of this weekend, it's over. Later today, I'll be heading to Sosnovitz for ice hockey for a little game between Zagorombia and Gekas. But we'll be back next weekend with hopefully two videos. Next weekend is the last round before the winter break. So I need to close it off with some good games. But thank you guys for joining me. All these games to book over. Uh, please like and subscribe. You know what to do. And we'll see each other in the new stadium. Bo-boo!